stuff. Like, I mean, there's some graph theory stuff. But it's not hard, the test. You should go, should be okay with it. Um, Do you say it's a test? Pardon? Do you say it's a test? No, 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 no. I don't have the test. I don't have the test. Oh, I have it on my computer, but I don't, oh. I don't have it. Do you have your <laughs> but yeah, like none of these, I mean, none of these questions are really going to help you much. Uh, it, honestly, I looked at it at like 3.30 in the morning yesterday, so, or this morning. Um, that's why I'm really super tired right now. Uh, but yeah, it, it's not a hard test. I told him there was one question on there that is sort of iffy for you guys. I don't know if you'll get it or not, but... Um, the rest of it's pretty simplistic, so um, I don't remember what you did for graph theory because we did totally a lot more. Um, we did a lot more network flow stuff. But yeah, if you guys have any specific questions on graph theory that you want me to go over. I can do it for you. So, yeah, network flows aren't on the test, which is usually like I find network flows super easy. Like the the way that we had them, like network flows was like the easiest. If you understand network flows, they're like the e it's the easiest test because what he'll do is like usually he'll give you like a graph of of network flow, and you have to determine what the optimal flow is yeah. on the path, and you just draw it in, right? It's like it's the easiest question ever. But um, he said that he didn't want to give it to you because he wasn't sure you'd, like, you'd have enough time to study it and whatever for the test on Monday. So he gave you like a, gra a graph, a graphing, a graph theory type of question. But it's not hard. It's like a, it's a pretty simplistic question. So I mean, it, you know, like basically you just just study over your like uh, your whatever he did did here. Like you know, you have a path from U to V. That kind of stuff, like these kind of kinds of questions, the graph search algorithms. Is it like uh, handling nodes that we have the nodes? Pardon? Is it like handling nodes? Yeah, exactly. That's exactly the kind of question it is. It's basically that kind. Of, it's you know, like if you look in into your like shortest path problems and stuff like that, you should have no problem doing it. it it's really, it's not a hard question. Um, and again, it's broken up into it's like your recur, uh, recursion test. So it's broken up into like A, B, C, D, E. So, um, the first question is like the easiest question ever. Like, if any of you get it wrong, I would be surprised because it's literally like a two-word answer. So, um, you should you should be fine with it. Um, but yeah, so I mean, like normally I would go over network flows, but he's not giving it to you this test, and I doubt he'll give it to you next test. He'll probably give you. Yeah, it's on the exam. It's on the exam. Yeah. So. We can go over network flows later on because I don't want to bring it up now. And you yeah. guys have just gone over it, so we can always go over those problems. But um, yeah, I never like I we never usually had like a, a graph theory question. Even in his like I said in his in his assignment solution stuff or his practice assignment, as far as I know, he doesn't even he mostly has like network flow stuff. I mean, he has a basic um, graph theory. Is there gonna be any running time or anything like that? Yeah, there's one question on on run time. But um, I don't know if he's gonna change that or not. Let's just see. Let's see if there's anything on here That's, that would be useful. Oh that's network flow. Yeah. Nothing here that's going to be So like I said, if you guys have any specific questions, you can ask me. Um, I'll be here again on Friday, too. 
So if you don't have anything now, that's fine. But uh, I'll try and look up something for you guys. He totally, again, he totally changed the test around again from the one that he originally gave me. I guess because he realized that he was behind in teaching you guys the stuff. So the original test was on network flows, and then he sent me the other one, and I just looked at it yesterday or this morning. So, um, so I don't have examples because I, I didn't expect him to just give you graph theory stuff. Um, and it's really hard to think of an example. It has loop invariant stuff in it. Uh, I'll tell you that. So, but you should know that from your what you what you've done with the node handling and stuff like that. So. Um, basically, you're gonna have to you're gonna have a, you're gonna have to go through a graph and figure out something about the graph. I, I, if I give you any more than that, it'll give me the question. And it's so easy that it would kind of ruin it. For, well, I'm sure you'd be happy with me telling you that, but I, I'd get in trouble. So, um, so yeah, I just look at your like shortest path problems, that kind of stuff, where you go through the graph, and then sometimes you you like have to back up and look at different nodes and stuff like that. Um, most of the questions are pretty simplistic, though, so should, uh, you shouldn't have too much trouble. Don't worry about network flow stuff. So I guess, like, the... Yeah, so I guess it's just chapter, whatever, 14 from your book. It's probably all you need to look at to know how to do the tasks. And then you might want to just just uh, quickly glance over your loop oh, and stuff, just so that you remember the steps and stuff like that. Yeah, because he just he asked you a, a one in one of the questions um, to just like in terms of loop invariant when you're going through the graph, how you would determine how to get to the next node and stuff like that. So like how you would start, you know, pre precondition plus precode gives you the loop invariant that, that kind of stuff. So. All right, so I, I, I don't have anything specific to give you today. Um, again, I'll be here Friday. I'll, I'll be here before class and after. And if you have specific questions, I'll try and think up, I'll try and think up something that I can give to you that's going to help you. Um, but it's not a hard question, so I don't know, like, I don't want to go into something so in-depth that you're going to, like, freak out or something like that. That should be pretty simplistic for you guys. So I'll try and think up an example that I can use to help you guys out. Um, I'll look over the question again, and uh, otherwise just bring bring whatever you have questions about specific stuff from chapter 14 and graph theory, then I'll be happy to answer it for you guys. All right? Okay. okay. No problem.